Hello. So we're gonna continue episode one of Game of Thrones. Yes. Yeah. Squishy noises. Not my best work, unfortunately. I suppose I have full enough. We probably should stop peering. <laughs> he didn't make it easy. What with all that bloody noise? <laughs> like a drowning cat. I thought he'd never stop. Yeah. As my no. father likes to say, hi, hi. a naked man holds few secrets, <laughs> so but the flayed man, the flayed man holds none. Pity he didn't know your father is the warden of the north. He does now. How, How much north? further is it to these foresters? Oh no. Uh, a day, my lord. Oh. Two at oh, most. No. Damn what you! I kind of, I, I kind of what, what I, I, blah, I kind of wonder that? what happens if you run, but let's not. I know I heard something. Cause I totally would not run. I'd be in paralyzing fear. <laughs> How about you? I, I, I don't, I don't know what I'd do. Paralyzing We've fear, holding your hands over your mouth and nose. Like when you're a little kid, you play hide and go seek, and you're like, I'm going to totally win, and then you hear the noise of somebody walking close to you. Good job, buddy. Good job. Why this? Buddy, no. <laughs> Garrett, why? Garrett, you don't want to know! Let's you just not. want to keep going! Let's not, buddy! Let's just keep going! Also, hold on for like one second while I fix the thing. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I need to fix something. Yeah, we needed to click out and it goes silent if you click out, so yeah. Well, oh, we don't. Can, can we not, not? Nope, we don't have an option. We have to. But, but. <laughs> Look at this upside down person. Yep. But they're kind of right. Oh, what the hell? Why'd oh. you come over, buddy? Why did you do it? You heard the screams, you heard the talks of filleting people. Filleting, not filleting. No, that was filleting. <laughs> we are not making him into a nice steak. <laughs> are you sure? <laughs> Meanwhile... Ethan! Lord Me, Ethan! My favorite. As I was saying, you are young. And you are not. And there are those within these walls who are uncertain of your leadership. I'm aware. But 300 generations of Forester Lords stand behind you. Is that so? Lord Gerhard the Tall, who founded our house, and your grandfather, Lord mm -hmm. Thorin the Bold, who seized back the river valley from the White Hills. What did they call my father? Lord Gregor the Good. I'm glad he was good. He was fair and wise. Yeah. And courageous in battle. I want to be like that. Like my father. Your You're father was well regarded father. by nearly everyone. It took years, if not decades, to earn. It's okay. These were your father's people to lead and protect, and now they're yours. But your father did not bear this responsibility alone. He oh and God. every forester lord before him chose one man whom they trusted above all others. The Lord Sentinel. Forester traditions demand that a new Lord Sentinel must be chosen. <laughs> yeah. Keep walking, you Look, I don't know that either one's really more. a bad choice. No. no. Summon the Lord! We need oh. Your judgment! Oh, this bit. Oh, frickin... I've frick done nothing wrong! Thunder. I was only trying to survive! Isn't that our friend from the beginning? Lord Ethan. Ethan. No, I don't think so. Mist. Why did you kick it? Oh. Who is this man? This craven is a deserter and a thief. No, I don't think that's what they're This house is doomed! Dude. Dude, chill out. We all Breathe. fucking know it! <laughs> Quiet, hey. thief. Dude, Eric relax. was supposed to be guarding our weapons, but instead we caught him stealing them. 
Two shields in three spears. Is Sir Roiland mistaken? Is what Sir Roiland said true? Yes, my lord. I fled. We should all flee. It's not stealing if you're taking what's yours by right. He speaks He's true. Right. I've a family to feed. And not two coins to rub together since Lord Gregor left us to rot here. Where's our pay? Our share of bread and wine grows smaller every day. <laughs> Stop hitting him, Jesus! <laughs> it's not doing any good, man. Well, Ethan, I know these words are hard, but they're honest. This house is falling. No, it's not. We'll never survive the coming winter. Together we'll survive. We are in this together. You say that, but it won't be you who's starving come winter. That, that is true. <laughs> You'll address him as Lord. Stop hitting him, Jesus, Lord sir. Ethan, you must decide the punishment. Lord Gregor always took a thief's fingers, three of them. Now may not be the time for harsh punishment. The men are on edge as it men is. Men need to know they cannot do whatever the fuck they please. Like, they you both have will not permit it. This is both. You're both. You can send him to the wall. <sighs> I don't think we should send him to the wall because he did say he has family. Yeah. But I also don't think we should give him mercy because that would be letting him off. I mean, if you want to do it this once, we can give him mercy. But I think we should just stick with father's policies because you can't really weaver on policies that are written. If you punish me, you'll be punishing an innocent man. Because he did admit to stealing. Please, we we can Lord. we can My show him mercy if you really me. want to this once. Let's try it. Let's okay. try it. I've never shown mercy. Let's okay. try it. Our house tends to its people. See, this man is paid and his family is fed. Lord Ethan, they make the sister happy. You are truly a merciful and noble lord. My lord, this man is a criminal, a brazen thief. He has a family. He's also a father trying to help his children after we failed him. I cannot punish a man for our negligence. You're rewarding a man who has no loyalty or honor. My lord, we must speak about our gold reserves soon. My lord, oh. I thank you for the mercy you've shown me. I will never forget my debt okay, to you. Hey, that actually turned out okay. House. That actually turned out okay. I'm so happy. <laughs> Because now she looks angry! <laughs> that was certainly unpleasant, but a lord must mete out punishment when it's due. Oh, Not just yourself, of course. Hmm? You can it wait on duty. any lord. It's a lord's duty, so I did it. You heard what the thief said. I expect this sort of thing will happen again. But a sentinel can help you in the face of disloyalty. You need someone you can trust by your side. Someone you can rely on, no matter the circumstance. Possessing I trust the wisdom. small council. I trust them all. That is what the small council I trust Lady Forrester. Lord, you of all people should know that too many voices muddy the message. That is why there is one Lord above all. That, that's and what so a there council must is be for. one advisor above the rest. There are two capable men for the role. They both want the job. Neither thinks very highly of the other. How do I decide between them? Talk to them. Solicit the opinion of people close to you. Here. The Bracer of the Sentinel. The Badge of Office. Tonight is your first small council meeting. It would be wise to bestow this Bracer upon your chosen Sentinel then. To show oh, that you are decisive and in control of this house. Please your not. Sentinel will wear this for all to see. Thank you. Thank you for your counsel, Maester. It is my duty. Come speak with me when you're ready to convene years. the small council, my lord. <laughs> he does. Like, I like the Maester. He, he's kind of a dick sometimes. See, so, like, I like him, nice face. but I don't agree with his opinions yeah. on economics. Yeah. And the question is, who to choose? Who did you choose when you did it? Like, who, who I, are you? I chose Roland. Royland. The, the yeah. angry one. Yeah. So I want to go the diplomat route, but if you want to not, then that's I, fine. I, I'd be we fine should talk to Ryan. Okay, yeah. Hi, buddy. We should check on our little brother, because he was there this entire time. Hey, kiddo. Hey, little one. Careful. Keep at it, and you won't have much left. Something to pick your teeth with. No, Ethan. Look at this. All good swords have a name. I call mine 
two brothers. I carved this to give me strength. And this, so I remember. I mean, I could never forget it, but... I'm honored. Aww. You Hello. made your brother happy. Yeah. <clears throat> Someday, I'll have a real one. But not like that one. Only a lord could have that sword. You'll have a good sword. I'm sure of it. I watched you today. I saw what you did to that man. We didn't, we didn't do, do anything. anything. Well, we gave him mercy. Was he our enemy? No. A bad man? No. Everyone keeps talking about them. I, I feel like the game has glitched. No, he's not our like enemy. We did yeah. So did a bad thing. Then I wish you'd hurt him. People who do bad things should be punished. Someone did something bad to Father and Roger. Child! Someone should hurt them even worse. Okay, I want a real oh, that's... No one's afraid of wood. I'll find the men who No, it's a Roger tyrant, someday, not a dictator. I'm sure I have a real tyrant. sword when I do. I wish you could comment on that and be like, No, kiddo, no. Please, no. Oh. Um, should I talk to the sis? Yeah, probably. Oh, this man? I don't think you can talk to the yeah. sister right now. Yeah. You talk to her later and she like randomly runs up to you and you can yell at you. Do it like you mean it. Ethan. Or should I say Lord Ethan? Hello, Uncle Malcolm. I, like I saw what you did today. I do too. It's not an easy thing to do. Showing mercy to a man who admits his guilt. Yeah. But if you'll excuse me, my lord, I should finish packing before nightfall. Where you go? I hope to be off tomorrow. Where are you going? Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Asher. Asher? She has asked me to return with him, to help the house. She said nothing of this to me. Because she fears you will not agree. I told her my place is here, that I'll be of no help to you in Essos. But she insisted. I will hold, of course, until you've spoken with her about this. Just try to be kind to her. She's been living a nightmare made real. Sure yeah. Did you know that just as well? Yeah. Yeah. She's my mother. Of course I'll be gentle. I know you will. He's a little mommy's boy. We have, we have made that this cannon. <laughs> I mean, dude, I want to make the mom the mom. <laughs> my people are scared as well. Because she's one of the most reasonable people. She is, and like, I mean, she yes, is afraid of her. Yeah. So wrong well, I mean, wouldn't you? Sure. It'd be a fine choice. And I trust him. How are you so I, sure? Sir Royland is the man you want. Why Sir Royland? We are at war. You need a warrior by your side. Royland has the respect of his men and will bring strength and discipline to this house. Duncan would offer sage advice, but now is not the time to negotiate. Not with the likes of Ramsay Snow. But can Thank we you. really fight? Ethan, I need to talk to you. See? <laughs> I knew it! Why are you mad at me now? I gave mercy! <laughs> I was a good! I saw what you did to that man. I can't afford any more mistakes. Everyone knows what happened with Lord Whitehill. Garrod being sent to the wall without my knowledge. I know! And that wasn't your fault. Well, I'm the Lord. It's my responsibility. The people want me to lead. They need me to, but... What? Ethan, please. Tell me. Yeah. Who should I name as my sentinel? It should definitely be Duncan Tuttle. He's dependable and God smart, damn it. and everyone trusts his judgment. Sir Royland is unpredictable and likely to make matters worse. You've always given me good advice. Thank you. Okay, she didn't yell at us. Uh, the conversation kind of clipped weirdly. Yeah. I mean, she did at first. She was like, angrily grabs arm. On, I'm dog. guessing they just You'll didn't record different. Forever. Yeah, probably. Beginnings of the conversation? Yeah. Anyway, should I talk to him? Yeah. Sword up! Swing left! Sorry! Wrong! Wrong. I didn't know it was <laughs> swords. The worst. Of course, my lord. I have many decisions to make, and I wanted your advice. 
How are our defenses? What's the state of our defenses? Are these men ready for what's coming? This lot, ready? No, but they will be. We post anyone who can hold a spear along the parapet, up where they won't get much scrutiny, and put our meanest, nastiest looking brutes front and center. That'll show Ramsey we're a force in our own right. You've got to project power, especially when you're weakened. Thank you, Sir Royland. I'll let you get back to training these men. Thank you, my lord. And uh, I'll be sure to watch out for more deserters. After today, I suspect there'll be more to but come. I don't like... think so, because we were we were really nice to and them. He was like, hey, you know. I owe you. I owe you, man. You did a good. And then, yeah. Thanks, bro. Raw. <laughs> Raw. There you are. Duncan. Yes, my lord. I have much to consider and face a difficult decision. Perhaps I can help. Your father often sought my counsel. Yeah. As lord, I must name a sentinel. Of course. And if I may ask. Who do you favor for the role? My mother. Perhaps I can share my insight. Why and talking can sometimes Gandalf? help you make a decision. Actually, I wanted to ask. Why did you send Garrett away? I did it for your own protection, my lord. Garrett had to go. By sending him away myself, I thought it would keep you blameless in the eyes of the White Hills. I only hope to give That's you clever. an advantage. That's a clever strategy. I do hope that's a good thing, my lord. Thank you. Duncan. You sounded so angry I about being advice. clever. I'm at your service, my lord. Well, no, he, no, because you know, clever people are the ones that throw you over. Let's not. Now, when I say parry, get that sword out. Look at the food. I, I don't think we should, because that's just depressing. Our provisions are rather right. low, my lord. I made the count again, just to be sure. Why are people starving? But it doesn't look good. Eric said people were going to starve. Why can't we feed them? The war has taken its toll. Even our own stores for the house are dwindling. We couldn't withstand a siege, my lord. If the Boltons or the White Hills cut us off and wait us out, we'd only last a fortnight. Yeah. But there are steps we can take. In the past, we've demanded food from the small folk to replenish our stores. We can do it again. If you'd like. We've That's done it before in desperate times. The last long winter, my else. family had to give all our pigs to the house. No, there must be something else we can do. Well, I hope we find it soon. We won't have much room to maneuver if we don't have the option of holding fast. I can speak to the huntsmen and trappers. Perhaps they can do more. Yes. My lord. Make things extinct. Do it. Rather than angering our people. Okay, we can go now. <laughs> we can ask his opinion, Mister. but I do not agree with his yes, economic Lord decisions. Ethan. I see you've spoken to a number of people. Are you prepared to name your sentinel? Yeah. What is your perspective? What is it you're doing over here? Admiring the ironwood, my lord. I studied it at the Citadel. The wood may be black, but I see gold. An entire forest of gold. What do you mean? It is our greatest asset, my lord. Why not give some of our ironwood to House Bolton and have them leave us be? We could ransom we ourselves. Come back some more. You can hardly put a price on your own life hmm? or the lives of those you love. Uh, ransom or extortion. Ransom or a robbery. He may pay him now, but what's to stop him from coming back again? Lord Ethan. The dangers of today outweigh the fears of tomorrow. He's taking the America approach. But anyway, okay. yes, dude, I'm ready. My lord, are you now ready to name it your sentinel? Time. Yes, I am. Yes, Maester. So I'm ready. We go Very back well. to see Mira again the before the end was. of this, yes? I believe yeah, we do. We do. So right now would probably be a good time to end it, or we can make this super long and then cut it in half. We can end it here. <laughs> oh, look at that. Yes. Alrighty. Bye, Bye. guys.